James Blake may sue the city of New York after being detained by a police officer last week. The former tennis star says it depends on what the city does to make it right. As Andy Rose reports, Blake wants to see changes in the way police deal with the public. It still strikes a nerve. James Blake says it's frustrating to watch the surveillance video. Saturday, the former tennis star told CNN that he has an attorney, but hasn't decided if he'll sue the city of New York. If we come up with solutions, then we don't need to take it to court. If we don't think they're doing enough to, to make this right, then we may have to, to consider a lawsuit. Friday, New York police released this surveillance video. It shows Blake casually standing outside a New York hotel when undercover officer James Frascatore rushes him and tackles him to the ground. Authorities say it was a case of mistaken identity. Cops were investigating credit card fraud. Blake says it was an unnecessary use of force. That just doesn't make sense when you're uh, investigating a nonviolent crime, a, non a supposed nonviolent criminal that isn't running, isn't showing any uh, any sign of resisting. It, it really is completely unnecessary. Frascatore has been placed on desk duty while the incident is being investigated. Both New York City Police Commissioner William Bratton and Mayor Bill de Blasio apologized to Blake. It's really nice, but this guy has five civilian complaints as well. I'm sure those people that, that have complained against him haven't gotten that same uh, call. And I think there needs to be um, an active apology to, to all those people that, that don't have the stature that I have. We need to find a way to stop this from happening. I'm Andy Rose reporting. The head of the police union says Frascatore was just doing his job and that he shouldn't be disciplined before the investigation is complete.